welcome back to the channel super snails we got some mantis kung fucious like kung fu get it because kung and then fu complete oh excuse me compete with fellow players in martial arts tournaments and see what earth's will was up to lottery week uh for post kawa song servers only k what song hmm uh, Minion Sim, Demon God Database, and Sim Core Online. So the K Wa Song servers only. So they they they're getting new stuff. So I don't know where that is. So I don't actually know. I looked it up and I, I I looked up and I couldn't find where this is. So whoever, if any of you guys are from this server, just let me know what server that's from. I'm curious. I could ask, but whatever. Um, okay, so yeah, so we have some we have some new stuff. Uh, so let's take a quick look at it. So I already know it's been a day uh, that we had the mantis and stuff out, but regardless, I I I figured go ahead and talk about it anyway because uh, what you may not know is how to dig when you go into these sections. Now this is strange. I don't know why people are doing that, but I maybe some of you may may know this and maybe some of you don't. I actually left my previous. Uh, snail club to join a much stronger snail club this club is insane it's probably like the number one club uh they are hitting really hard we are on day two and they're already at t6 it's bananas it's strong and we don't even have like the little power-ups these guys right here not well like like a lot of us grabbed this one right here so if you're if you're going into the the uh the species war and you're digging and and you're and you have enough resources to buy to get this right here and buy either the the uh, reduction speed for collection or the damage or the troop casualty reduction then that's what you should be focusing on this you should not be focusing on the coin first you should not be focusing on the uh, the, 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 the the speed up the, the pickaxes nor the tickets you, those will always be there until the next time it comes around but you will get many more resources if you collect obviously these right here if it increases the speed at which you, you you dig at the bottom and this will also it you know help you take less damage the thing the reason i did not pick this one is because everyone in the club that i just joined is vastly stronger in the previous club that I was in, I was strong enough. This my main account was strong enough to be one of the strongest players. So if you're going to be a spearhead, you need to get this one first. If you're going to be one of the primary heavy hitters on your team, I, I personally believe that you should get the troop casualty first. And that you should have other teammates, the weaker ones, the ones that let's just say you 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 guys get to level four to t4 by friday end of week right when this is about to transition out your last day is thursday uh, you you guys hit only t4 because your club your club is just filled with a lot of really young snail accounts or a lot of afkers or you have a lot of inactive players that have irl issues and they just you have a very very comfortable relaxed atmosphere and not and no one's like oh i'm trying to be number one i'm trying to be number one right if you have that kind of club and they're and you have really really okay casual diggers let them do the digging and you should be the spearhead and you should go there now if you join one that's like having that you don't have enough like your snails aren't strong enough your your um, your minions aren't strong enough to go deep down then you should be a digger and not a casualty fighter so so for me if if you look at if you look for me at the people that are in here like 60 80 70 50 100 60 Right, my account is in the 40s, 45. Right, so I, like I, I'm like someone like this guy, uh, or this is my alt account. Right, I'm digging. I'm going to use my account for digging because right now, currently, I'm hitting super soft. I'm super. I'm I'm not hitting hard at all. Like 60. Like these are just average. Averages here on this account on on this on this team is like 40 and up, 40 and up, which is really nice. It's just, it's re, it's very competitive, and at this point in, in in my snail journey, right, 
I am strong enough to want to be with a group that is very, very strong. Y you have to be competitive. Like if you go to a club that's just chill and relaxed and you don't want to be chill and relaxed, you have to find something that is a better fit for you. There, I, I don't believe there should be loyalty to a game. I believe there should be a loyalty to your teammates. But if your teammates are casual and and in your mind you're ready for the next step and they're they, they're okay with whatever then you could still be friends right but you need to go somewhere where you where you your new life is basically starting right um that might actually be like a life lesson <laughs> it, it, it's something you can apply to real life um, if you're ready to buy a house get married and you have friends who are constantly drinking partying and you know this part of your life is like okay well i it's something's calling me to do too big do bigger and greater things than just doing the the casual cool things that i was doing yesterday if that's something you want to do then you have to do that you have to follow your path and allow everyone else to follow their own because when i left the the, the previous when i when i left the previous um group that i was in i felt bad but i also made sure that whoever wanted to come and jump into this team did so first. I let them know, hey, you guys are invited first. There are stronger people who may want to jump and you you guys have every right to go first, even though they invited me. That's, that's the kind of person I am. I'm gonna allow you to go first. It just so happens we had enough room for just a few of us to go and we all went. So it all worked out. That's, that's the kind of player I am. So here's how this team wants to to operate and honestly i've been preaching this for a very long time you go straight down you dig you dig you dig now i don't i truly don't understand who is doing this because all of these little ones and stuff right here i don't think they're necessary i think you should just be holding your drill bits they even say it right here like remember drill bits carry over for the next day what they're trying to tell us and something that i already know is if if i have 24 and the brick that i'm about to crack open is 25 don't use it today. Don't come over here and be like, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, until you hit the 24. You don't have to be at zero every day. This is only day two and this club's already at T6. We need to get to T7. So in order to be T7, you need your drill bits. So what you do is you save them. I Again, I don't know who's doing this. No, that was just an accident. I'm literally trying to click over here. I'll just click over here because nothing's open. So we just... The, what's supposed to happen here is you're supposed to go straight down until you hit like the the very very deepest depths now let's just say okay for example your team st struggles by the end of the week at this at this tier uh whatever this level of this guy is right you would naturally just go ahead and then you can start digging around and that's when you start digging like the the, the range uh what is it two uh five and eight because this is one two three four five six seven eight nine when you do that, when you dig between lines two, five, and eight, what happens is you clear, you open up everything. So if you were to go here, and this was completely done, so we have to kind of go in and out so I can show you what I'm talking about. If you come here and you wanted to find a brick of the specific T7 material that you're looking for, or T5 or T4, etc., you click here and it'll tell you, you need to break this one. This is the one that is required. Now, if you can kill the boss that is here and go further down, it'll automatically, it'll automatically give you, I think it's like, if you're at T5, it'll open up like T3. It'll automatically give it to you. So, the, so it, it, it benefits you to get down there as soon as possible. It benefits you to reach the bottom, work the boss, go to the next bottom, work that boss until you hit a wall and when you hit a wall everybody should be hitting that fucker man everybody should be trust trying to take that out now if your casualties are insane like you're taking 25 to 50 25 might work 25 might work for you but if you're taking like 50 percent casualties 70 percent 100 percent casualties it may not be worth it because your best units are not doing much and then they got to go heal and it takes you a shitload of time a young account may take much longer than uh, an account like mine, for example. Like, I'm maxed out in the cloning uh, department. Not the cloning, but the healing. Like, if I come here and I upgrade it, I'm maxed out. And at max percent, it's 25% reduction. When you hit the wall, when you need that little book for this, you don't get 
minion recovery speed percentages. You don't. So you're at the you're at the mercy of the speed at which this recovers. Where when you get that little book, I, I forget how to get it. Uh, when you upgrade this completely and you get it to level 30, it'll increase. It'll go faster. And and the stronger your your minions go, or get stronger, the, the longer it takes. So you want to get them. You want to get them in here and 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 heal them up as fast as possible. Another reason why I like this wooden golem is because he actually takes a lot less time to to uh to what do you call it um let me look at him real quick he does self-recovery 12 percent reduced by the 25 percent on top of that so he's awesome i love this guy i'm not saying he's my strongest because he's not going to do like the dps but he's going to has a 66 percent chance to take injury for your units so it's very he's a very valuable unit i go i go whatever right now i'm going to so, so right now i have um my t7 uh form right now is what i'm rolling with so if when when you get this t47 form again my opinion i could be wrong and if i'm wrong i don't care it's up to you to choose your path but i'm advising that if you want to go the t7 route which you should because of the weapon the 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 circuit the circuit is the staff uh this one right here which allows you to give get penetration right if you if you 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 by proxy level up your zombie minions first because they're, they're going to be first because you got him to T7. The second one I would do would be immediately this one, the the um, the robot section, uh, the mecha version. Why the mecha? Because that's where you can start upgrading those those uh, those minions that I was talking about. The uh, these guys right here that do this, so they can take a hit for your much stronger army. But some people don't agree with that. And if you don't agree with that, that's fine. Don't do what I tell you. I don't care. It, I'm not telling you what to do. No one is actually telling you what to do. But I will advise that that's why I do. I'm giving you guys a, a glimpse of how my brain works, how how I do the things that I do. So once you get to the bottom, you you fight. Like I said, you fight like hell. You try to get the 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 the. the you try to unlock this next level and then you save your pieces until you can go ahead and go even further now this is gonna happen this is gonna happen sometimes you see i said row two five and eight well sometimes there's gonna be some stupid shit that's just gonna be there so the best thing to do is dig around it like this and keep going back straight down onto that row what a lot of people like to do and it fucking infuriates me is they like to go here and oh this is the path of least resistance yes it is the path of least resistance because going here is kind of counterintuitive in your head. You think, okay, well, I could go here and instead of going sideways and then down, which takes two bricks, 50 or, 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 or whatever, 45 here, right? You could just do 25 and then I'm already one down. I'm already closer down to the next level. But the thing is, if you need valuable materials from this lane, you're going to have to go that way anyway. Whereas if you open it up here, they just automatically open up they they make things available like this is available and this is available right if we go straight down here or if we go straight down here this is not available to us it's not even if we hit row eight this is not available to us so you want to always dig down rows two five and eight now a lot of you guys who are veterans know this i'm sorry if you're hearing this again and i'm sorry if you're hearing this from me and you're like, I can check out. I don't care. It's good. Good. <laughs> I'm glad you know that. But there's a lot of people that don't understand this. And they like to just go straight down. Because it's, it, it feels like the, the path of the... It's wrong. You have to keep... it. We're trying to go straight down. We're trying to get down to here. So what's the easiest way to do it? Go straight down in one line. If, you, if it makes you go around like this, just go straight. Just go around it and, go, and then stay on 2, 5, and 8. Always stay 2, 5, and 8. You don't have to do 2, 5, and 8 on your own. You just... Keep going. Trust me, someone is going to follow you. Someone's going to be like, oh, okay, I see how he's digging. Boom. And I go, boom. And I go straight down. It's just, just please. <laughs> that's I'm, anyone who's new, anyone who doesn't know that, just that's the way to do it. That is the, the, the most appropriate way. Because look, now I have access to this. I have access to this. I have access to this. And that's that's what you want. You want to have access. When people start digging all over the place, all willy-nilly, it's, it's wrong. It's totally wrong. So... Unfortunately, there is no Mantis, no um, Chronicles. 
This thing just came out. <laughs> and I don't mean to sound mean, but it's like, damn. Uh, cool, I guess we could start collecting stuff, but we don't get much intel on what is going on with the Mantis section. You can click on them. They'll tell you, hey, we just want to fight. But there is no tournament. There is no PvP. There's no... There's nothing. Because it's not here. It's not available. Um, there are some things that dropped like uh, this. That it's... it's Unfortunately, that's not available to us either. That is that is one of those things that it's not available. If I go here to the teleport. And I think it's right here. No, it's this one right here. And I click here. It tells us feature is locked. If... <laughs> it... it uh, I don't want to. I don't want to. Again, I don't want to sound like I'm bitching and moaning. But it, you know, a year into the whole Mantis stuff, I I, I feel like it could have been ported. If that if that's what they were working on, it it, it could have been ported over or 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 ported over when it's when it's ready. <laughs> it's okay. I would have gone another species war without it because I I would have been at least collecting the pills. Uh, but it's okay too because this is also granting us uh the ability to at least. Uh, get ahead because we we can finally start you know getting the uh, these guys right here so it it's it kind of sucks that we don't have it but it also kind of sucks that it, it would have sucked had that we didn't have these right here so at least we're starting to get something because it where I'm getting I'm 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 taking a beat down <laughs> I'm taking a beat down I am no I'm no longer I no longer feel strong in this club because this club is going so strong. Uh, we were we were struggling with T6 by Thursday in my previous club, and this is day two, and this club's already at T6, working on T7. Um, if you're on a club that's got like that, you're on like struggling at three, but you feel like you're strong enough, you 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 feel like you're the spearhead of your club. It's t I don't care if you're the president, I don't care if you're a a, a, a manager or if they love you there. Uh, if it's time to go, it's time to go. It's time to move on. You need to go find a group that will make you stronger and that is not a diss on the previous group that you had it's very important that you understand that there you're playing a game that you're trying to grow grow stronger faster as soon as possible you shouldn't feel bad about leaving a club it, you should i don't just i guarantee you if you leave that club and you go to a new club and it's like you leave you leave a club right and and the club is like level, I don't know, seven. And you jump into a level nine or ten. All of a sudden, they're like, you're like, holy crap. They're 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 a lot stronger. They're, they're, they're constantly talking. They're like, join the Discord. Go here. Do this. Do that. And you're like, oh, wow. And all of a sudden, it's a little more. The vibe changes. You got to get used to things. People are like telling you what to do. They're like, hey, I need you to dig because you just got in. And you're kind of weak and whatever. And that's fine. All of a sudden, you're like, oh, shit. Things are different here. Things are a little spicier here. Things are a little... They're moving. Whereas your previous place, you were the one that was, like, trying to move everything. And all of a sudden, you're like, holy shit. I found a new home. And then a couple months from now, it starts getting... Like, it starts to slack or something like that. Find yourself another home. It's okay. Your shell, you outgrow, you outgrew your previous shell, and now you want to move into a new shell, and you should feel okay about that. And I think you should, you guys, if you guys are stuck in a shitty club, I say shitty, I don't mean shitty, I don't mean like the people are bad. I'm talking about like this is the, the 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 culture is just just chill, but you want to progress, find yourself something better, and that's okay. That's not a diss. I don't mean that as a diss. It may sound like a diss. It may, it just may sound like a diss, but I, 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 trust me when I don't, when I say I don't mean it that way. At some point, you're going to feel a pull, and that pull is going to take you to the place where you need to be. And that is, that is what I mean. That is what I want for you guys. Go where you need to be, and that place, that new place, that new place is gonna. It's like. It's like you're ready to grow. It's like it's like a it, it's like a piece of like it, you're a seed and you're coming out of the ground and you're just pushing. You want to push. You just want to get out of this of the dirt. And once you get out of the dirt, you you hit a level. And then all you just want to keep doing is just keep growing. You just want to keep getting further and further and further to that top. So uh, I went super preachy, <laughs> uh, but I hope that helped. Um, there's nothing going on.
<laughs> the mantis section there's nothing going on unfortunately but i got to see new cool stuff hopefully you guys at least understood that priority number one when you come here and you want to buy any of these any of these right here the first ones you want to get are these books priority number one if you can get this book this week which is gonna be really hard usually you get like one book per per cycle um because we already got this one i already got this one and i believe we got this one yeah so because i'm digging currently on this on this section on this cycle i'm digging i'm a digger this one and, and the next cycle i am going to attempt with my main account to be part of the 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 assault team basically right uh, but I also don't there, there's a limited supply when you come here and you click on and they tell you hey do you want to be Vanguard do you want to be uh, labor or do you want to be whatever the other option is uh, there's a limited supply of them so you should definitely allow your strongest people to pick those first and if you know you're you're, you're not too strong you're gonna be a digger go dig go dig it'll be faster you'll get resources faster the whole team grows faster because you know your role your role is to dig you can look at the teammates that you have and you could be like the average is let's just say the average is 50 on all on your whole team except for you and like 10 other players out of 50 and you see the other 10 players are like 30 or 20 dig it's okay it's okay <laughs> okay hopefully you guys understood hopefully this wasn't a shitty video See you guys on the next one. Peace.